All right, so with this, ladies and gentlemen, uh, as mentioned earlier by Mr. Batra, let me welcome on stage Mr. Anand Kripalu, MD and CEO, Diageo India, our honorable jury person, uh, to share his views and thoughts about the jury process, please. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Well, hello, everyone, and a very good evening. Um, I just want to start by... Uh, uh, thanking um, Anurag for having invited me um, to be the jury chair this year. Um, it's it's uh, uh, been an absolute privilege uh, to play this role, but I must say that we've had a lot of fun along the way, so it's, it's been good fun. Um, and I've enjoyed this personally, this entire exercise, because uh, I believe that I'm a marketeer at heart. Um, I have spent uh, a good part of my career uh, doing marketing, working through, you know, kind of all levels, a brand manager, a marketing manager, a marketing director, you know, those kinds of roles. And I've worked across categories as well, um, starting my marketing career with oral care, um, moving on to detergents, then many years with chocolates, and, uh, and now the last few years with uh, alcohol brands. And somebody asked me, what's the, Anand, what's the method to your career? I said, well, through my career, I've just uh, moved up the scale of indulgence consistently. Uh, I do not plan to do anything after I've done with Alcobev, by the way. Right? I'm going to stop right here. But anyway, it's been great fun. Now, the uh, Indian Marketing Awards really is a, a celebration and a recognition of marketing successes. Um, so it's about marketing at a holistic level. And that means um, the clarity of what we're trying to do through marketing, uh, the consumer insight that's being leveraged, um, translating that into strategies that have impact, uh, executing that in the marketplace, and finally, and probably most importantly, ensuring that all of this um, delivers impact in terms of achieving what the brand set out to do. Now, uh, this time, uh, we had a large number of entries. There were a large number of shortlists, in fact, that you know, we had the uh, opportunity to go through. And I must say, it was heartening to see the quality of work uh, that was done across industries and across brands. Um, uh, personally, you know, for many of us on the jury, in a span of a few hours, and I must say it was a fairly uh, intense few hours, uh, I don't think we gave people uh, even an opportunity for a break, even for lunch, really, because we had to uh, do justice to what we were uh, uh, charged to do. But in just those few hours, we got really an, a phenomenal exposure to the best uh, work that India uh, has to offer. And I think for somebody who has marketing as their, at their heart, I mean, that itself is um, uh, an absolute privilege. Uh, the other thing, and I think Radhika, who was one of the jury members, pointed out today, is that um, digital has really come of age. You know, uh, it was not long ago when uh, every brand, uh, when I was a brand manager, uh, the word digital hadn't been invented. Okay, so you can imagine how long ago that was. Today, then there was a period when everybody used to ask you, all right, the ad is great and everything is great, the pack design is great. Are you doing anything on digital? And today, it is the centerpiece to everything. There was not a single entry, I think, that did not, um, in, in, in some ways, leverage digital or have digital at the heart of their entire strategy. And I think that's a big shift uh, in what's happening, driven by technology, but being embraced by uh, marketeers alike. Now, the proof of any successful strategy finally lies uh, in the results, be it the metrics uh, of the brand uh, or the business, such as sales, profitability, and so on. And all I will say is that um, if there was one bias we had during the judging process, it was about making sure that any award um, was met with results, business results that were impactful. So if there was one um, slant we took, it was about making sure that uh, the, 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 the entire marketing effort delivered uh, business results. And I think that's something which is a message for all marketeers. I mean, ultimately, um, you know, in my early 
years in marketing, I would sit with uh, marketing folks and say, why are we doing this? Uh, well, we've done all of this because this will enhance the image of the brand. I said, wow, that is absolutely a laudable uh, effort. Now, how much of the volumes of the brand moved by? Uh, well, not quite, right? We're still waiting for the volumes to move. So I said, which is this brand that has great Im image with no volume, right? And we're not really interested in brands of that kind uh, in business, right? It is to deliver volume uh, and deliver uh, profit at the end of the day. I must say I was very proud of the jury and how we came together uh, on that day. Um, and it was a balanced jury. We had professionals, we had entrepreneurs, uh, and we had people from different fields. Um, and I think just the, uh, the power of diversity of thought uh, really came through uh, 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 during the day when we were doing the judging. And, uh, um, you know, I, I, I think I really believe that, uh, I don't know whether we did a good job or not, you can decide that. But uh, I think we all walked out with a clear conscience that we had done the best we could have done and we were absolutely objective about the recommendations that we made. Um, I just want to say a little bit about people who put in a lot of effort to submit nominations. Um, you do great work and you submit your nomination because you obviously aspire for an award and a recognition. But if you don't put as much effort in the quality of your submission, sadly you're going to leave it to the jury to deduce what they want to deduce from the stimulus, right? And marketeers know better than anyone else you put poor stimulus of a great idea in front of a consumer, it will be rejected. Right? The stimulus is sometimes as important as the message itself. And if there's one message I have for people in the future is, please put in the extra effort, the last mile. Right? Finally, how the, 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 the marketing mix shows up on shelf is everything. Right? Um, so please put in that little bit of effort to make sure that your submissions are of the highest quality. And finally, we spent a lot of time, probably more time than on anything else uh, during our day uh, pulling the uh, awards together, on deciding somebody who would get the Lifetime Achievement Award from, uh, from the Indian Marketing Awards. And uh, as you would imagine, I think many of us were um, humbled by the fact that most of the names that were put up there were far more eminent than we were. And um, really, it was a tall task for us uh, to really, in some ways, pass judgment on who should receive uh, the Lifetime Award. But we did the best we can. Uh, we took into account various factors, like uh, the track record of those individuals uh, at building strong brands over their career, uh, whether they had created a category where none existed or redefined the rules of an existing category, uh, the longevity of tenure, so did they stay long enough and truly build that business? And remember, this was all done from a marketing lens, so it's not about just building the business. It was about building the brand uh, and the company behind the brand. Their personal contribution towards innovation, and finally, have, have they created a legacy that will live on much after them, not just in terms of brand, uh, but also um, in terms of the team that will be charged to taking forward that brand uh, and that business after them. And therefore, we gave a lot of time, a lot of deliberation, uh, and I hope all of you are, um, are impressed and pleased with the decision we come to. I think we're all proud of the fact that the person who has been uh, uh, awarded the Lifetime Achievement Award is absolutely deserving, right? Uh, and I think we have no cobwebs in our mind as far as that is concerned. So that's really what I wanted to share. Thank you again for this privilege uh, and the pleasure of having been associated with the Indian Marketing Awards this year. And uh, on behalf of myself and the entire jury, um, warmest congratulations to those who are going to walk away with awards this evening. Um, and better luck next time. Keep trying. Huh? Life is about uh, trying, trying, trying. In the end, you will succeed. So keep trying. And hopefully, if you're not there today amongst the winners, you will be next year. Uh, and your time will come. So thank you, folks. Thank you very much.